Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Ben Esterly Gaming here on a tutorial for Medieval Minecraft Hot Air Balloon. And let's just get started. As you see, you're going to start with the base, the basket, obviously. Might as well start from the ground up. And I'm building off of a tower that I built off of a survival mode server that I play on called Madcraft Gaming. Um, sorry if it's a little fast for you. The video came out half hour long. So, as you see here, it's just doing the top uh, connections from the basket to the actual balloon part. And since it is in survival, it is limited resources and there is I, I do not have flying in this one. This is uh, traditional just like flying adventurers basket, nothing too special, you know, just something to look nice if you want to add it to your creative world, you know, just something to make your town or city look a little bit better, something that's off the ground other than everything being on the ground and plain like always people have there's not a lot of um, air things that people do so I thought it was I saw a couple of different versions and I I just decided to go with my own I never built one before I ended up building another one after this which I think came out a little bit better since I had more skill I believe after doing this one I had more knowledge of how to handle doing it since you know first hot air balloon you're gonna have screw ups and you're gonna want to improve some things so as you saw before I went and got the piece of wool that I dropped um, I'm adding a block around on each side you'll see why it's for the glowstone to hang over what I the pi pictures that I saw all had like uh, like a big tarp draped over the top of it kind of thing and I liked that idea and I thought it looked cool so I tried to do my own version of it on this one since it's a first try not really sure how to make it look just kinda going you know just seeing how it comes out especially since it's not creative it's just survival and like I said before, there is no flying on this. I have a ton of wool thanks to Shannon, my girlfriend, and this girl Amanda we play on play with on the server. It's called Madcraft Gaming. You can check us out. But I'm just doing a little bit more, making it look a little bit more defined as the balloon. Just taking my time. Just adding more details and everything especially being in survival it's just very tedious especially being up in the air I wouldn't recommend doing it on survival like I did it's it's very heart-wrenching especially when you get close to the edge even though you do have shift I did did do this on the PC so it is it is easier because you have the mouse to aim and here is the attaching where I'm starting to attach and make the the top tarp cover attached to the actual balloon itself just making it wider making eventually gonna have it attached to the actual balloon which you will see later on and just little details making it a little bit better and then I came inside and of course like any hot air balloon would have you have to have heat so I just threw another rock in the middle and hit it with a uh, flint and steel to catch it on fire it gives a little a really good effect from the inside and especially at night time when you see it um, just to make it look a little bit better especially if you're inside or at the right angle outside you can see the flame so it does look really nice 
from the outside. Most people just use like glowstone or whatever just to give it lighting. Like, yeah, whatever. Just get it over with. But I thought the nether rock, and it's far enough away where the fire from the nether rock won't catch the wool on fire either. Like I said, being in survival, it would happen if it was closer. Like if I used wood closer to it, um, where that would catch on fire, it is possible that the whole balloon would have gone up in flames. So just be careful when you're doing that part. Here I'm just doing the top part of the balloon and making the top tarp. Um, just attaching it, finishing it off. And it does take a little bit of time if you do it in survival. Creative, you would just build a pillar up and do the base and go from there. Just doing a little bit more details for the tarp, making it flat, making it look more like it has actual air inside of it. And just finishing off the top. And there you go. Let's go across my boat and check it out from that angle. Let's go back to my castle. Looks a little bit good. Let's try it from over here from this side see how it looks from inside my castle going through my old res uh, I've done a lot on this one I'll do a walkthrough later on of the entire castle so you can see the ship and yeah I liked how it came out for a first try I thought it wasn't too bad so gonna come back in and delete that at the right angle you can see the fire just making sure it's there and didn't catch anything else on fire and there you go you can see a little bit of the tarp and the effects I wanted to make it have like make it look the tarp was covering the top so thank you for watching like comment subscribe leave me feedback on how I did whether you liked it or not alright see you all later bye